Today we're visiting Studio 23 in Bay City and joining me is Megan, the Executive Director. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. Yes, this is a wonderful place. I feel like this is like a hidden gem in the downtown of Bay City. How do you feel about that being said? Um, we've heard that a lot, actually, and um, a lot of people will walk by and say, like, we've walked by your space, but we've never, you know, had the confidence to come in or never yeah. thought about coming in. Um, so we want to let people know that we are free to the public. So yeah. come on in. Um, you do not need to be dressed up and you mm -hmm. can come in however you are. Um, and we welcome you to walk around our galleries. Yeah. So tell them what all is entailed with Studio 23. So we are an art center, so we're not quite a museum. Um, mm -hmm. We do have programming, we have classes, we have exhibits, and then we are big supporters in public art. So mm -hmm. um, we coordinated some murals in Winona Park over the summer. Nice. And then we have this space that we are in currently. This is our Rowley Gallery, our biggest mm -hmm. gallery. Wow. And then on the other side, um, we have our Tabor Gallery. And that. Uh, usually houses our smaller exhibits. Mm -hmm. And then this is our bigger exhibit space where we have six to seven exhibits per year. Okay. We have a large classroom down here that a lot of our painting and drawing classes take place. Mm -hmm. And we have a clay studio upstairs where we hold our pottery classes as well. Why is the accessibility even more important, just touching on what you just said? Yeah, so in our uh, mission statement, it is to make the visual arts relevant and accessible to all. And we really mm -hmm. take that to heart. Um, and so we're really looking at expanding our, um, what we cover. So public art, we also are planning um, a disability and DEI exhibit for 2025 that'll take place in the gallery um, for those, uh, geared towards those that are visually impaired. Yeah. Um, so that is in the works and we're very excited for that. And we're really working on getting our space um, accessible and physical and social and mm -hmm. all of the different abilities. Yeah. So talk about, you know, why galleries like this are important for artists who are looking to express themselves. Yeah. So here, um, the only requirement that we have in order to sell work is that you are a member with us mm. and memberships start as low as $30 a year. Oh. So it is very easily uh, or very accessible financially. Mm -hmm. um, students, veterans and seniors can all get that $30 a sure. year membership and then it jumps to fifty dollars for an individual so um if you are a member we will happily display your work mm -hmm. um both here in the rowley gallery during exhibits and in our off the wall gallery which is our member gallery mm -hmm. um, and we have like 70 or 80 artists in that right wow. now so yeah for sure well thank you so much mm -hmm. i appreciate it this is such a beautiful <laughs> space you know Folks will definitely have to come check you all out. Well, tell Absolutely. them where they can find you. We are at 901 North Water <laughs> Street. Uh, we are in between Painterly Pottery and Winona Park. Yeah. And we are in the Jenison Building, if that helps.